Praise be to God. Daily one missionary biography. Today's missionary, Joan of Arc. Date of birth 6-4-14-12. Date of death 31-5-14-31. Homeland, France. Place of vision, France. Becoming a martyr is about sacrificing for a principle and a belief no matter what the cost. We can see this in the Bible. Stephen was stoned to death for being a witness of Christ. Paul died for preaching the message of Christ. And the Lord Jesus Christ died for all mankind. Joan of Arc also died for her faith. Born a peasant in a small French village, she lived a life of faith from the beginning to the end. When Joan was 12 or 13 years old, she believed she heard heavenly voices. These voices, she claimed, urged her life to live a faith and to never deviate from the righteous path. As she grew, she claimed those voices were preparing her to liberate France from the English, who were at the time successfully acquiring the French. Not being timid about sharing her faith, she told others of her voices and her mission. Her faith inspired many of them to believe in themselves and trust that they could drive the English out of France. She lit the fire of faith in the hearts of her countrymen. She convinced King Charles to let her fight and she led the liberation of Orleans. During the fight, she encouraged her soldiers to pursue godliness and preserve their righteousness and faith. She solely depended on her faith to protect her. It enabled her to be bold and fight the battles despite being injured twice. News of her faith and valor moved the French nation and rekindled the people's faith. She kept her heart pure, remained humble and communicated what God wanted for his people. Through faith, she was able to overcome tremendous obstacles from lifting the siege of Orleans to winning essential battles and crowning Prince Charles IV at Reims. At the Battle of Campania, Joan was ambushed and captured by the English. She was falsely accused of heresy and was burnt at the stake in Rouen, France. Beloved, does your walk with God and faith inspire others to push on during turbulent times? Lord. Let my faith inspire others to raise up, have hope, and live their faith in Christ despite the challenges.